years you've been gone have not been kind to me, Gum. Constantly running from loan sharks. The feds. Broker than a dead dick dog. I couldn't get another swipe. I am sorry to hear, hear about that. You listen to me, Gum. I have waited eight years for this. Go ahead. I had to change my name, erase everything. Then there's that little matter of the bullet in my leg, a constant friendly reminder of the partner who ruined my life that night. Come on, man, really? We're gonna go back there? You did that to yourself. Semantics. I want my share. I want my share. But the $10 million that was gonna change our lives forever. Vinny, there is no cash. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I had a feeling you'd say that, Gum. I burned it just before Harlan got to me. No, stop it. It's true. What's taking so long? Uh, hold on. Wait a minute. Who, who, who? That voice. Who was that? Oh, that's right. You don't know. I'm a cab driver now. My fare is this sweet little girl trying to get to her shrink's office so she can discuss her daddy issues and how they have manifested into an unhealthy disdain for the world at large. Hey, what are you doing? Hold on, please, gum. Sorry, miss. Terrible fat Tuesday traffic. Be there in a jiffy. See how it lays. Now, gum, it all depends on whether or not you're going to stick to your story about burnt cash. You touch her and I'll take you down the levee and kick your fucking ass. I don't know if you heard what I just said, but this all depends on you.